Hi, I'm Daniel from Jobber. Let's go over how to customize your request form. First, let's go to the request settings. You're going to click on the gear icon in the top right corner of your screen, then select settings. On the left side, under the client communication category, you're going to click on requests. Let's click customize form to start setting the form up. At the top of this page, you can add a short description of your services or follow-up details that will show up at the top of the request form. Next, we have the contact details. You'll notice that these fields are grayed out. This is because the contact details will all be automatically included on your request form. The address that's submitted here will be created as a property for the client. Next, we have the service details section. The section name can be customized as well as the default long answer question. If you don't want to use the long answer question, you can simply click on the question and then select the red trash can symbol to delete it. You might want to replace it with a checkbox question, a short answer, or even a drop down. Remember, you can have multiple questions within a section. If you run a lawn care company, you can use a checkbox question to allow customers to select multiple or single service options like weed control, hedge trimming, fertilization, etc. Short and long answer questions are great for when you want to collect specific information that might vary between customers like lawn size or a description of the specific service required. Drop down questions are really good for single selections from options. Questions could be like, how often do you want service completed? With options like weekly, bi weekly, monthly, bi monthly, or even quarterly. With a drop down, the client can only choose one option. You also have the option of setting each question as required so that the customer cannot submit the request without filling out certain fields. Next, a form can be set up which asks which dates work best for the client. The form also asks about preferred arrival times, which you can customize. Click the arrival times section to remove or update the available arrival times. If you'd like to add any additional sections to your request form, click add new section if you removed it previously. You can also click the three dots in the top right corner of each section to open the More Actions menu. From here, you'll be able to move the section up or down or delete it entirely by selecting Delete Section. Once your form is set up, click Update Form in the bottom right to save your work. To preview what your request form will look like to your clients, you can click Preview Form in the top right of the Request Form template page that we started on. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions, make sure to check out our Help Center.